How you doing, guys? I'm Trenton Henderson. You're tuning into the infamous Living Rim Network. Divine powers are always working for us because we're trying to do right. Remember, guys, make sure you're showing love to everybody. Random acts of kindness. Just walk up to you know strangers when you go out places and just say, "Hey, how you doing?" If they don't want to talk, let them go. We don't want no drama. We don't want to fight. None of that. Just you know, be kind, be cool and collective. You know, just always try to show love wherever you go. And in the future, this cause could cause a great effect. So with that being said, let's get right down into it, guys. I want to talk to you guys about Chief Keith. Yeah, Chief Keith. For those of you who listen to rap music, um, I'm not going to necessarily say go listen to Chief Keith music because you might not be used to the type of music that he makes. But um, I actually listened to Chief Keith maybe like two or three years ago uh, when he first came on the scene. And um, just recently, I've been listening to a little bit of his music nowadays, you know, and it's, it's still kind of like the same and whatnot. But, um, you know, people make changes, you know, and, and people are always bettering themselves everywhere. I mean, there are a lot of people who don't better themselves, but we're not focused on that right now, guys. And um, Chief Keith is just one of those guys who's just like us, Rim Team. Um, he's trying to make himself better. He's trying to make other people's lives better. He's trying to make the world a better place. And... You know, just like I was telling somebody an hour ago on the phone, as long as you're making progression every day or every month or every year, you have nothing to worry about. You are successful. You are always becoming successful. You are always evolving, becoming your greater self. And so Chief Keith, um, he was talking to this therapist, this, this uh, certified um, psychologist, I think, uh, PhD. His name was Dr. Siri. You can look this up you can type in chief keith as a matter of fact i put it in the, in the in the description section right below this video and you can go to this video and watch it yourself but um what i what i really want to say is something that you can learn from about chief keith is that no matter what you how you grew up no matter how you grew up you know everybody's always given a hand of cards right and it's up to you how you deal those cards out because you have to win no matter what and we're not talking about DJ Cal. Win, 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 no matter what. But you know, everybody's given a different hand. Some people are fed a simple spoon when they're first born. But even we see now that even when you're born rich or you're born better off than most people see it as, you still might have problems with meeting humble friends or meeting friends that are from the gutter or meeting friends that are from the low life or meeting people that are from the slums because you can't relate and you want to relate so bad like or if you grew up like in, in in substandard conditions if you grew up like in a hood or something like like me like where there's a lot of thugs and gangsters but i didn't stay there you know i had aspirations to go further maybe you stay in the maybe you're in a position right now that you want to get out of and you just don't see any light you don't see any path opening up for you i guarantee you listen now listen for somebody who's been there before i guarantee you if you continue to believe continue to make yourself better i guarantee you doors and opportunities will begin to come your way and before you know it, you'll be in a different place you'll be like man i remember i used to do this i remember i used to be here i remember i used to live here I see it all the time, successful people going back to where they used to stay. Like, wow, it's so different now. Now they stay in like this big mansion, you know? And so Chief Keith did just that in this interview. You know, he gave you, the audience, me, you know, what it was like for him growing up as a child. And then the therapist actually got down into his mind and saw that Chief Keith has a good side to him. And he does. Everybody has a good side and a bad side. And, you know, some people like to dib and dab in the bad side more than the good, but that's okay. As long as you know who you are. And Chief Keith knew who he was, you know, in this interview. And it, and it, and it showed brightly. You know, um, he's a great guy, you know. And just because, you know, you, your image is like this outside in the world, you know, just because you have to keep up an image, maybe for entertaining reasons, or maybe because your career doesn't mean that you have to always portray that everywhere you go and so that's what the ther therapist was trying to get chief keith to understand like you don't have to you know you don't have to like you know give power to this part of you that you really don't like as much as your higher self you know that is just music but you are brighter than even what you think you are so keep that in mind folks just keep in mind that you're always better than how you see yourself 
And this is what life is all about. It's about awakening. It's about awakening to who you are and coming to the realization that you have everything you need right within yourself and all the supplies that you need are right around you. Through friends, people, circumstances, situations, supplies, everything is around you to build what you really want to, what you aspire to be. Okay, so I'm going to put the uh, link in the description section, guys. Please click this link and go watch it. Chief Keith, one of my favorite artists out there doing it big, straight out of Chicago, you know, and man, this kid is awesome. So, Rim Team, go check out this video. Hope this message resonated with you. I'm Trenton Anderson of the infamous Living Room Network. I'll see you in the meantime. Peace.